say on this because I used to play Falco and uh, that's sick. I've never yeah. played Falco before. Yeah, Falco is cool, and um, Atos now plays Falco. Yeah, so. I saw that. He's doing pretty well. He did well the weekend. Yeah, so he got a very good Falco bracket in the sense that he got Dashy, who's an idiot, and Falco <laughs> you can actually just like abuse that with. Yeah. And then he got Stabby, who's like probably not played a Falco since I played him. You know, first, second month of the yeah. Like and a that's year a, ago. like good, not like good matchup because it's Snake, but it's like. He's one of those characters where if you have it's a Falco, you're just like, he might just be better than my character, mm. for God knows what reason. Because you can just reflect everything and force Snake to actually interact. That's true. Which is huge, because like most characters can't do that. Who's he playing, Lyrico? Uh, yes, Lyrico. He'll be playing, yeah, Lucas. Uh, uh, the just oh, that is not set up. Okay. Well, we'll get to that. Interesting. Well, so I'll start on an Atos. Looking fairly even. Alright, yep, yeah, good forward air. Oh, he gets the drag down. Interesting. Very nice. Yeah, he's gonna realize very quickly that you can't laser the. Yeah, he's looking for the magnet. Magnet. It's like you. If you're playing Falco in this matchup, what you wanna do is start lasering early like he is. So they think, oh, I can just side magnet and heal. They and then go you for just. The magnet and then then you just it. forward air them hella yeah. off stage when they're expecting you to just sit on stage and thing, and they die super early. Watch your back air. Next one. Doesn't quite Probably take kill. it out, but you know. Oh, this oh, could I be rough. Definitely would have grabbed there, but yeah, yeah okay. up to a back air, yeah. That's true? Uh yeah, against most of the cast. Interesting. Yeah. It's very good. It's just, you know when your opponents only are doing it, it's hard to hit. Mm. It's like it. Yeah. Whereas up throw up air I think works and is just a kill confirm on oh, Ness, and I'd imagine would be on Lucas as well. But none of that matters if you could just down smash the guy out of a side B. Yeah. Kill him at like 70. Yeah, up tilt, up tilt. Yeah. But yeah, that's probably what Peter's going to work on with the Falco combo game is reading how a guy is going to come down and just getting a lot of damage for it. Still looking for those magnets and the yeah. lasers. Yeah, it seems like a good idea at the time, but you only. Ooh. Another down smash? Oh, is that Peter dead? Nah, not quite. I think if Lucas had the like snake, he'd be mm. uh, not snake yo-yo. He'd be yeah. really dangerous. Oh, but back air spike. Back up air? No, not, not quite. quite. <laughs> All right. Oh, he could have probably got stuck on there. I don't know. Hard to say. Love it. All right, up air. Up, up air. Yep. yep. It doesn't hit super hard, but the up air scales a lot more than you think. Mm. So if you got another one on the platform, it might just do it. Not without the rage, though. Good for Yoko just hitting the up air. Oh, that's such an up tilt. you got to take those. Oh, nice to pick up yep. fire. That's yep. dead. Yeah, if you can up tilt back air with Falco, that changes everything. Because it means you can just spam it like crazy and be like, well... <laughs> You get hit by this, you die. I hope you know that. Yeah. And, and then all of a sudden they can't go for the rest of the stuff because they're so afraid of the up tilt. Misses That's the up smash, gets a big punish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you air dodge and you think you're out and you just not because Falco can just do 40%. that. Looking pretty even at the moment. Yeah. I wonder what that side magnet was for. Reading a laser. Oh, gets one. Okay, gets one there, but. Yep, good. Hey, oh, that hits. That, that, yeah, kill? that kills. You got to up air there as yeah. Falco. You got to. Like, that's one of the things that Falco is really good at is you side B to that exact spot where they can't hit you. And then you double jump up air and say, This is my ledge. Get the mm. hell away from me. Because <laughs> the up air, the jump is so fast, they can't really do anything about it. And then if you think they're going to read it, you just mix up air dodge. Oh, and just no. go straight to the ledge. Stock icons. Oh, my God. I keep looking there and going, there's nothing there, why am I bothering? Mm. Oh, no, sure, do that. 
Very quick start from the Farco. 24% already. Oh, 31. Yeah. But keeps adding up. Strange up smash. Yeah, that, I don't know what that one's about. Oh, he re waited for the roll in and then didn't believe in it. Alright. Interesting. I think they were both going for the up tilt there, so good to know that Lucas has, like, slightly safer there if he hits a back air on shield. Mm. Alright. Yeah. I think Peter's also got to realize what ranges Durko's going for the side Bs and just reflecting them back, because I'm pretty sure he can't mag with them in time. Yeah. Like, it's not unless oh. the old range, yeah. Durko's edge guards have looked very good against Falco so far this set. Yeah, very solid. It's like good DI on the up tilt as well to not get comboed. The down smash two frames are ridiculous. Yeah. Uh, yeah, up tilt back air, very strong, just in every matchup. Like, if you can hit that, it's a game changer. All of a sudden, you go from a character with, like, very linear kill setups to, like, oh, very linear kill setup that you can't really avoid. Yeah. It's, a, it's, a, it's rough. Yeah. Peter playing the patient game, trying to come down. And yeah, that's... Up tilt, there it is. Oh, gets a magnet. Yeah. A little bit of healing. Every bit counts. Yeah, particularly against a character like Falco, who racks up the damage really quickly, but can't really... Like, after the combo range, you get him, it's like 70, and it's like, you get it's up like tilt you into to stuff. Get that last bit. Yeah. Like, and if you can get out of that combo range, it's really big. Yeah. Thank you for that. Right there. Oh, we'll get some PK freeze. Huge. Oh, good fold out, yeah. Interesting dash attack. I, I feel like the Oko has been a little bit off for just like. A tiny bit the last couple Ooh, of things. misses the down smash. That's yeah. unfortunate. Well, I think that was a good angle from Atos, yeah. right? He, like, delayed it that little bit. That was. Okay, yeah. yeah. So now Atos is a little bit nervous, partially because of the... Yeah, and he's missing the up to back is Partially because of, like, the situation, but also because the Oko started DIing them either way. So he's got to think about that a little bit more. It's not as automatic now. Yeah. Which could mean a lot coming into this last stock if he's last you know, could be, not yeah. just killing him at 100 when he gets these up tilts. Right, what's he got? Right, good nap. Surprised the forward air didn't like somehow catch the landing, but yeah, yeah, that's the first up throw we've seen. You get a lot of damage off up throws, so that's, that's why I'm surprised. Already. Yeah, like yeah. Are you up there, up there, up there, up there, whatever you want from there. Like, like, it's a lot of damage if you can hit one. But I think because he's using so many up tilts, he doesn't feel the need to. Right. Yeah. That's a good stall. Up. Yeah, the, the magnet to magnet, float. Yeah. So That's so unfortunate. The like, magnet didn't come out in time. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Interesting that he's DIing the... Okay, there we go, yeah. Yeah, going to game three. Um, interesting that he was DIing the um, up tilts behind him, which normally you'd think is terrible. Yeah. But just... Because Peter was expecting him not to, he was just like, oh, I'll go for the reverse one, because, you know, better coverage. And all of a sudden, not so good. Cool. cool, we got player camps. Hell yeah. Hey, Pokemon Stadium. Yeah. Stadium, just good stage in general. Yeah. Like, did they play game one here? I'm having mental blank. I don't think they did. Okay. Because, like, I'm not surprised when people play two out of three games here. It's just yeah. like, yeah, okay. It's the most, like, neutral stage in a lot of people's opinion. Yeah, that's what I've been looking for this whole set. The is shine. Just to, like, yeah. reflect it, get the, like, easy like 12 damage take all the stage away from him because it sends him reasonably far read the low jump didn't quite get it a big forward air actually 
Yeah, that was so clutch because he was stuck in the corner for so long. Yeah. It doesn't look like it's going to matter all that much, but. Yoka making great use of the tether recovery. Yeah, Falco doesn't have a whole lot to cover that. It's one of those things where you'd have to like really hard read them going for it, yeah. and if they don't, it's like, oh, they get back for free and get to like, you know, back air me. I'm imagining, yeah, Lucas would probably not be in a very good spot with the PK Thunder recovery. Yeah, Falco yeah, particularly just... Falco can just drop down and yeah, like fair, fair down B. Yeah. Also oh yeah, that's that works. Flex stuff and can hit Lucas if anything else. Yeah. Yep. Ados in a very good spot right now. Up till up down it, up air for classic. Nice spot dodge. Yeah. I feel like it's one of those weird things where because he's got the lead, he's just making him come to him for the first time in the oh, oh okay. Yeah. As you do. That's Lucas. <laughs> Still Ados up by hundred percent. Yeah. He's he can kind of let Lucas just come to him. Yeah, I think that's what he's been yeah, doing. He's like, trying to like, yeah. Yeah, he's definitely looking for those up tilts. Oh, parry doesn't get the punish. Yeah. Though. He's gotten very one-dimensional the last minute. The weird thing is he could probably just run up and grab it. He probably could. And like, I'm fairly sure you can up throw up here, Lucas, because you can do it to Ness. Mm. And it looks ridiculous because you full double jump up there and you're like in the blast zone and the sparks go off. You're just like, what happened? Oh. Yeah. That's another reason why you don't want to. That's another up B. one. Yeah. Don't take the ledge; you're just dead. Yeah, that grounded hitbox will get you every time. You're not used to playing Falco's on like a regular basis. That last hit of forward air just like lasts forever before it comes out, and always get you're just like it's got to be done by now, and then you just off stage like every time. Oh, that was a really good drag down. You get a lot of damage for it as well. Yoko kind of on the ropes at the moment. Yeah. Oh, beautiful drag down. All right. Oh, such a long snake. Mm. Right. Yeah, Athos just willing to let Yoko come to him. Yeah. And I don't blame him. He's got. The yeah, and he's yeah. got the like laser forward M 50-50 game going as well. Oh, this oh, we could get back be, here. Yeah, that yeah. that might have done it. Right, yeah, good forward arrow shield. Ato's very hungry for these up tilts, so. Are that killed? Apparently. What a world. Right, so this is the crab. Yeah, Ooh. this is. Stalls of momentum. Yeah, the stalls have been very good. Can Lyoko turn this around? Atos only really needs one good hit, and that's yeah. set. But the thing is, Falco's only got three or four moves that'll kill. That's one of them, though. That's one of them. That's yeah, it. that'll do it. Well, good games. Right, who we got next? Yeah, who's up next? Right, who's up next? Now Cakes and John. Okay. Interesting. Cool. Well, I will be jumping off because I got a game to play. I will see. I right assume songs. I do as well, but I might just sit here until it's confirmed that we have someone else to sit down. 